just uh, someone asked, Laura84 says, minimum amount to invest in Bitcoin to make at least $1 million by 2030. Ooh. That's a lot. What do you think? Uh, to make at least $1 million by 2030. Uh, 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 what year? By are we? 2030, or man. 24? I, I think that. Uh, well, so if you have one Bitcoin now, do you think that'll be a million by 2030? I think three Bitcoin might get you there. Three Bitcoin, so that's two hundred ten thousand at the current. Yeah, two hundred ten thousand at the current price. Yeah. Uh, All right, there's your answer. So, now, but but maybe Laura, look at it this way, right? Your upside is unlimited. Your downside is what is the downside? You I know, look at Bitcoin and go like, will we? Is Bitcoin ever going to be less than a trillion dollar industry? No. It, 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 it makes no sense to me that we would ever see a 30% drawdown from here. That's why I like to look at Bitcoin as a market cap. Crypto Crow saying 150K. You don't think... Uh, Crypto Crow, good to have you in the room. I love having you other guys in this. The, you guys that are doing the other... Like one, I support all you guys doing this podcast. It's awesome. Um, and, and love having you guys like uh, collaborate. Uh, and, and you think it's going to be 150 Crypto by uh, 2030? Ooh, hope you're wrong there, pal. Well, right. I think he's saying invest 150K now, oh. and it'll hit a million. It'll do a five and a half, eight X. So you don't think Bitcoin will be a million by 2030? One Bitcoin will be a million bucks? Well, I guess that's a Chris I, I, question. I, I, don't think that, I don't think that it needs to be a million bucks to, like, like why, would this, why would this person need a million? Yeah. Okay, that, that, that's my... I mean, would it's the I, wrong question. Well, like, first off, a million dollars is not a lot of money in 2030. One million dollars no. in 2030 will not be a lot of money, guys. That might buy you a bag of bread, <laughs> depending on how bad well, things get. <laughs> could, could but, but, you know, it's not a lot of money. You have a tax event, you're going to have to pay, you're going to end up with 600 grand. Yeah. Right? So, seven, 700 grand, and... Um, you know, the, to me, the question is, what other asset class would you have that you would even consider with 10x or 15x? Why would it need to 15x? I'm okay with a 3xer over five years. That's my minimum. Hmm. A 3xer, it's done 45%, okay, for the last couple of years. So 45% times five years is 250% return. I, I just think that... Um, no, no, it's more than that. It's a, it's, it's a, yeah, it's 250, 300% return. So to me, if I get a 300% return, awesome. If I get a bigger return than that, it's a gift. Um, it's safe. Yeah, Fibboswami has a funny, funny point. We're assuming the tax rate stays the same. You might only get 200K. Yeah, see, says. I agree with him, but I, I don't think you can do anything on taxation now. No. You, you'll destroy you the market, okay? Well, no, you can't charge me more tax. It'll destroy the market. Do you think they care, though? I, have they ever cared about destroying the market when it comes to taxation? Isn't that actually, don't they purposely try to destroy certain markets with taxation? Um, well, they end up with so many loopholes. I mean, I don't, I don't. I just don't worry about the taxation piece of it, but I mean, I, I hear what Fib's saying. It could be the case. I, I, uh, the more tax goes up then, as Bitcoin matures, it only leaves me in a position where I'll not make, I'll not liquidate any of those. Yeah. I will find a way to leverage my Bitcoin. Yeah. Oh, for sure. For sure, dude. You start getting many, many hundreds of Bitcoin, you, you'll be able to go to a bank. And with other assets also, and say, hey, look, I, like, I'm not even leaving this here anymore. It's either give me some leverage, or I'm going to move it to someone that will give me some leverage, that will free up my, that will allow me to move around my Bitcoin without moving my Bitcoin, right, without taxing the Bitcoin. So I don't think they can do, like, it, it, look, you can't tax your way out of this problem. There's only one way, to, there's only one way for the U.S. government to fix this problem and it's not even fixable, print more money. There is no other solution. They will print more money. It will yeah. drive all asset prices up. And then you're going to have to figure out when to sell and get the fuck out of that shit. That's my opinion, okay? Like, 
there is, you continue to stick morphine into the body until the body decides it is going to just go into full-on rehab and go through the pain. There is not a politician on this planet that's willing. One, you're not going to get it voted in. Yeah. But saying, hey, we're going to dest- the economy is going to be destroyed here for the next three years. We're going to go into a major depression and reset everything. Yeah. Who's going to win, win any election on that? Nobody, dude. And the whole planet, even the crypto bros, they want the U.S. government to print. They would love Steve Mnuchin back, dude. Just print it out, dog. Just print it out. 